Um, Al Chini is the managing partner and the creative force behind the brand and cultural alignment toolkit. Al is certified to administer and interpret several psychological instruments, such as the Myers-Briggs type indicator, DISC, and the Thomas Kilman conflict mode instrument. But his greatest focus is using BCAT. I said that right? That's you got it. Perfect. Uh, to, his, his greatest focus is using BCAT to deliver mm -hmm. insights and actionable guidance that help leaders and employees all row in the same direction toward a shared purpose. BCAT is the result of Al's career-long immersion in the effects of people, personality, and purpose on company culture. It's an interactive culture-building tool that begins with the incorporating question. Imagine your whole team as though it were a single person doing its best work on its best day, mm -hmm. keeping all of its promises and accomplishing all of its goals. And it's not in the bio, but I want to add this. Not sure. just imagine your team, but imagine yourself functioning at that mm -hmm. level. I was going to be sharing with ways that BCAT can help a company, no matter how small or large, find its North Star to keep morale high, productivity constant, and revenue strong. Very impressive bio. But the thing that's more impressive than your bio itself is, is you, you. Like they say in branding that you, know, you are your brand. Uh, just from the, the 25 minutes we had ahead of time to kind of chat and talk, I see that you truly are your brand and you are everything that is written down here. Yeah. Um, but again, nobody else was, was privy to that information other than Jeremy and I. So we kind of got that sneak peek. So let's start <laughs> off by, uh, why don't you share with us kind of who you are, um, and what you're all about. So we, we can all get to know you before we dive into the big questions. That, that is such a great setup, Brooke. And one of the, one of the reasons why I'm glad to be here is I've met, I made a new friend already. And that is you. <laughs> Thank you. It's really a pleasure meeting you. I've, I've known Jeremy and we've had a couple of conversations, but it's, it's great to be here with, uh, with the two of you. And philosophically speaking, I guess the three of us now working together have to think about how we can help a fourth person. Mm -hmm. Yep. And um, so uh, really quickly, uh, I grew up in a middle class hood in South Philadelphia. I was never any particularly good at sports, but I was really good at getting all the other kids to come out and play. I was great at that. So as a child, I figured out that I had a natural kind of a gift for facilitating others. It with, uh, without directing them, without forcing them, without having to coerce them, I was just right. really good at getting that red laser dot to herd the cats. I was good at that. And I, that's what I did as a kid. And over the course of time, I developed a career in technology and uh, ended up a contract project manager at NBC Universal and used a lot of what I learned as a kid. I mean, everything you use today is based on something you learned years ago. I mean, our lives all accumulate that way. So everything I learned as a kid paid off in my adult life and my early career and then later in life. And all of that rolls up into this thing called the Brand and Culture Alignment Toolkit, which uh, which is my current commercial offering. And, uh, you know, as it plays out, yeah, well, you'll see as, as I'm going to give you guys an exercise to start with. And I'm hoping oh, yeah. the people that are watching the program will play along. Um mm -hmm. Uh, because it's it's uh, it's really the core exercise. 